Hi guys, we're going to travel today. What's, what's wrong? Balls. <laughs> no, <Not> you. <laughs> but anyway, guys, let's go travel. Oh shit, I know where I am. What the hell happened? My husband, my husband put the bricks in the back of the <laughs> tires while he was changing it because he stepped on a, a, he got a nails on the tire so he went to the shop and had it fixed. Now he forgot to get the, the rocks, the bricks out of it. <laughs> oh my goodness. But anyway, let's travel towards, we're traveling towards north side. So, get ready guys. I'm gonna reverse the camera. Action. Let's rumble. All right. I'm going the north side. The north side. Oh man, they put those bags for the uh, the garbage that they picked it up. It costs about a hundred dollars to pick that up. The green one. Man, I got bitten by a yellow jacket. Not black jacket, not red jacket, yellow jacket. <laughs> My husband laughing at me. I called him a red jacket. You need to quit driving like that because you're bouncing my head. And I keep on bouncing that pow! These are the neighborhood. We're gonna be driving. I can't find my uh I still have to sit down and get my uh stuff. That's oh they put a lot of bricks in that house. They changed that lot of brick in that house. The stock is gone. But anyway. Say hi hun. Say hi. Hi hun. Hi the muño talaga oh it's so skin on. My hip in car? Hola. Oh, yeah, I think. I think I'm going to go to the I'm going to go to the But I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to But anyway, this is how the situation is. No question, no answer, but I have a little bit of a uh, uh, quote from the knowledge quote what you mean no the, the knowledge I'm talking about is some people are using the brain that is not uneducated some people are educated but they're not using the brain mm -hmm. so those knowledge are different the thing over there is some people just want to stress anybody from the vloggers of the youtubers I've been uh, I have been giving an advice to people just ignore them but they cannot ignore it, especially Mary Ann said that she's just a human. That I understand. The reason why they're not ignoring it, because those people, they keep on doing that, bagging you and telling you some stuff, and then they're gonna tell them don't speak English because you, you don't speak good English. Well, that's, that, that's not the point. The point is, whether you speak English or not, at least you're speaking on it, but well, some don't. They only got a minimal of uh, English because it's like Mary Ann said, we just throw it there and we throw it here. But some people just speak English without using the book, but some people are using the book. Then there's a situation that you went to college, but you're not using your brain. You went to college, but you are the, the respect, disrespectful person. You're nothing. So now, the situation of the uh, go ahead guys oh I almost hit that but anyway a lot of people why they get pissed off like that why they keep bugging why they keep irritating people why they keep manipulating why they are stressing people because they're jealous because they cannot be on the top the same as those people that are on the uh vloggers that lives in the US some of them like oh I see a lot of them 
that was committed saying that how in the world did American marry that ugly Filipino? Well, it's not about the looks, it's not about what you got on the outside, it's what you got on the inside. Some are not listening. And the thing of it is, they just want you to uh, do some uh, cropping. So, it's up to you if you're going to get into that situation or you just have to go turn around. If that was me going through my channels and they do that, guess what? I will ignore all of that because I am not putting myself to the category of the people that are illiterate and didn't use the brain. They just used to being a dumb person, ignorant, and some of them that they cannot make it on their dream because they are not on that area. The thing is when people think about, oh, I'm going outside the United States, oh, I'm going to be working. I'm not putting everybody on the same category. Out of 1,000 Filipinos, 95% are jealous. 5% are the, what in the world is my, what are you touching my leg for? You can do that in public. That's my leg too. No, the name. It don't say it's in the marriage to do that. Yeah, it do. Not a date. I never print. seen the list. Touch leg every now and then. No, heck no. I never seen the print like that. But okay. anyway. Yes. You're bugging me so I cannot do my uh, little bit of talk to people. But anyway. Now I'm going. I'm going to try to continue. But sorry that, guys. My husband kept on touching my knee. For some reason, I don't know what it is. And some people, I'm not against the OFW, but some are like, they just went out somewhere, they work, they make money, and they act like who they are. Like they are very uh, important in something in life there on the top well to make it long short story I've been through a whole bunch of everything I went to the shoes of people I've been there I'm 62 years old and I I heard a lot of crap on it so you just push the ignore block their butt they'll be okay you'll be okay don't stress yourself guys because you just gonna make yourself sick I'm sick on the situations with these people. It's okay if you don't speak good English. At least you understand what the goddamn American is talking about. That's a big thing. A lot of them, that I've seen a lot of them in YouTubers, they're pretending to speak English. They're trying to be slang, but they don't have no respect to themselves. And I see that when their husband is talking. They just overtake, take advantage of them. That's not good. Disrespectful people. And those are the people that I always say, illiterate, ignorant, and dumb. Those are the people that I just... Why do you have to get here? But why? This is Jimmy. Yeah, but the other the other is in the other side. Me? I'm driving on my bikes. But anyway, guys. We Filipinos are very sensitive when it comes to something. Especially the Visayan. Where I come from, they call the place uh, gentle people. And we're very gentle. But I learned a lot of things when I traveled in Europe and U.S. Everywhere that I learned, I was forcing myself to be tough like my papa was telling me no matter where you go no matter what you do don't let anybody to step in your foot because a lot of people that you're gonna be encountering are dumb I seen a lot of people that <coughs> excuse me they are doctors and nurses I came from the family of that but they didn't use their brain a lot of them just because they are a doctor, I thought you're going to the man. 
But you want to go to the Boston Market? No, that's what you think you should. Well, I said, you, well, I changed my mind and said it's coming here. That's why I asked you if you want me to go. Yeah, I know. And I told you, uh, no, I need to go myself. Didn't I? Well, I didn't know. If I knew that, I shouldn't be coming with you if I know. Well, you did. But, so I told you straight out. Okay. Just give me some fish, please. This one here, I, I can relate to it. I want, uh, what you call that? The, um, hush puppy fish and coleslaw. My, what is that, that one, one right meal, there? Huh? That one right there? The, the, no, the meal right there. And the seafood meal? In there, yes. fish? No. Yeah, it's fish. Or the grilled fish meal. Or what is that fish and shrimp hunt? The one in the bottom a little bit? Go ahead. Uh, oh god, look at the catfish meal, your favorite one. Right there on Oh yeah, the, and it is. It's uh look like it's a sampler. And it's got fish and uh shrimp. Grilled white fish and shrimp uh skewer. That one. That's a meal, too. Well, we are a couple of days. I thought we were going to the other side. Right there. What is the black stuff there? Fish, shrimp, and crab cake come out. Full meal deals straight out to $4.99 right there. Mm -hmm. You got a nice meal, hot fish, and popcorn shrimp. That's the same one they got right up there. Oh, how about that one's $4.99? Oh, that's a starting. I don't want a French fries. I want a uh, fish puppy. Just give me the one with the shrimp. The grilled uh, white fish and shrimp because, you know, I don't eat the fish that much. You mean the deluxe platter there? No, the one over there. First one in the bottom. This is about the salad word. Oh, right there? Yeah. Grilled white fish. That's the grilled tilapia. Shrimp. Tilapia? Yeah, no, it's fish. just white fish. Grilled, grilled white fish and shrimp skewer. Above the salad. Above the salad word. Oh, grilled white fish and shrimp Yeah, yeah. Okay. That's not no tilapia. That's what I want. Your, your catfish is over there. Mm-hmm. You got two fish and two pieces chicken. I don't want it to get four piece chickens. But anyway, guys, those people that uh, we always bug because they don't know or they don't make no nothing. See that one right there? Mm -hmm. Grilled white fish and shrimp. Okay. That's what I want. Thank you for choosing Captain E. Be with you just a moment. Oh, okay. Look at you. The catfish. It's not, not the two pieces, but the one below that is just four pieces shrimp and crab. It's a four piece white, white fish at the bottom. No, right above that is this catfish uh, feast. Above oh, okay. that. Yeah, did you see that? Mm hmm. Yeah. That's what you need, catfish. But anyway, those people, uh, when they get jealous, I don't know what they look like or they have a picture. Uh, shout out to Marianne, to Gina Weber. Uh, Marianne, uh, can you please private message me that uh, person that was doing the two, if you got a picture, and let me see. But anyway, I'm just being nosy, Marianne. I'm trying not to be, but I'm just being nosy. Oh, that's where the, the, that's where I used, that building over there, that's where I used to have my business. I backed in. The other one is on the other side, but anyway. <coughs> we've got all of this. Um, I'd like later. to start with the uh, grill 
white fish and skewer. Right that black and lemon pepper and original seasoning. Oh, what was that again? Black and lemon pepper and original seasoning. What? Black, blackened, lemon pepper, the lemon, lemon pepper. Lemon pepper. Yeah. Lemon pepper. Creamy, is it cold salt? Okay with that? Uh, what was that again? Creamy, is it cold salt? Okay with that? Coleslaw, yeah. Coleslaw, yes. Can we do it one more side? One more side? Yes, sir. Uh, what is the other side? A hush puppy. Hush puppy. What else can we get started for you? I'd like to get uh, the catfish feast. Fries, coleslaw, and green beans, okay with that? Yes. What else can we get started for you? That day. Matter of uh, uh, For which side? Catfish pieces. Extra. Uh, I'd like to uh, also add to that, uh, get another order of, like get the uh, deluxe seafood platter. Fries and coleslaw, okay with that one? Yeah. Yes, uh-huh. What else can we get started for you? Ah, uh, that'll do it. Salvador so white fish and shrimp score, lemon pepper, with coleslaw and pesco feast, a catfish feast with fries, coleslaw, and green beans, and a deluxe deep platter of fries and coleslaw. Is that correct? Yes, uh huh. That'll be 2984 at the window. Okay, thank you. You're very welcome. Well, guys, I'm gonna let you guys go. But for now, uh, shout out pala to Kuan. Little, little one. Ziggy, ziggy, ziggy. Uh, I saw you reading those uh, words that your mama prepared it for you. So wait till ya. Uh, and uh, I saw you guys swimming in the pool. I just, uh, I was just watching it on the television, so I cannot just push the like because I was not set up to do that on my TV yet because I'm getting tired and I didn't like it in the TV. So I had to go to my computer and do that later on, but I did it on my cell phone. So guys, talk to you guys later, and thank you. Appreciate guys for you being here with me. <laughs> I'm gonna eat some fish. <laughs> anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. And it's not a mukbang; it's a muk muk bang bang. Bang bang. <laughs> my husband is it? What? Yeah. Oh, because of the air condition. But anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Oh, anyway.